What's up, bro? What's going on? It's another update, another day. A few topics we're going to run through. So we're starting with a throwback person. I call a throwback person somebody you probably ain't thought about since for fucking ever, if ever. Um, Zachary Ty Bryan. He made bail. In case y'all don't know who that is, he played one of Tim Allen's sons on Home Improvement. I don't remember which one. He wasn't JTT. I remember all that hysteria and shit. All the females love JTT. I wonder what he's up to today. But that's Tim Allen and him. Those are like the only two people I really remember from the show. And the dude with the fin... Wait. Was the dude with the fence in front of his face Mr. Feeney or... No, I think it was on Home Home Improvement, too. He talked to some dude. Anyway, he should be home by now, by the time you hear this, from getting busted for choke allegedly choking out his girlfriend. And they say he wasn't in jail for that long. He's got a mugshot where he looks pretty unbothered. Looks like, and according to TMZ, this happened in Eugene, Oregon. And he was booked on three charges, including fourth degree assault, strangulation, and interfering with making a report. Uh, looks like he posted $8,500 cash bail in Lane County on Saturday night. It's all that old school work he put in. That shit's still paying off residuals. That's what's up. But what's not what's up is if this shit is true, bro. Don't put your hands on women. And women don't put your hands on men. Just be grown. Talk through shit or Shit, I got more respect for you if you dip. Get out of the way of the situation. Motherfuckers don't need to be hitting each other. That shit's whack. So that's what's going on with him. And in other news, we got Fauci versus Trump. You know, I know we got to wait until November to see Tyson versus Jones, but this will do for now. They're both calling each other out. I mean, Trump's basically in his statement that I heard, he's saying people are tired of COVID and how his rallies are as big as they've ever been. And, you know, people are basically just saying, fuck it. And I see that myself. People don't give a fuck, mask. All that shit is going out the window. People are like, bro, enough. If I'm gonna get it, I'm gonna fucking get it. So. And he's calling Fauci out as one of the people trying to keep it going, basically, and saying that Fauci called all of them, pretty much every one of them wrong. So I don't know. And then Fauci pretty much responded with some Godfather quote shit, talking about, oh, it's it's like the Godfather. It's nothing personal. It's strictly business. You know, I just want to do my job. I don't know. They don't fuck with each other, but that's old news. When he, uh, when Fauci was giving Trump the side eye, you knew he was like, bro, this is a fuck nigga. Like, he never respected that man. They don't respect each other, but Fauci's shit is visible. So, we'll see how that turns out. Getting closer and closer to the election date. Make sure you get out and vote. I don't give a fuck. There's really no excuse. If you don't vote, I mean, they're, they're pretty much almost bringing it to your door, so. I mean, do fucking something that day, you know? Otherwise, don't talk shit. Either way, don't talk shit. Keep your shit to yourself if you don't participate. But in other news, the city of Compton. That's right, where NWA, a lot of the real niggas come from. They're launching a pilot program, according to CNN, that will guarantee free reoccurring cash payments to 800 of its low-income residents says it's for going to be for two years. So basically, it sounds like they're going to try out what Andrew Yang was talking about, universal basic income, which is what we need, because where the fuck are all the jobs going, you feel me? Shit's leaving and not coming back. So people are going to need a way to eat. So I'm just glad to see. And I heard about in a few other cities, they're trying out some things um, as far as along the same lines. I mean, it's just good to hear stuff like that. People need fucking help. So shout out to Compton for being part of the wave, part of the future, because I believe in the end shit. That's where it's going to be at. And speaking of money, today is the deadline for the stimulus to get done prior to the election. You know, fucking with Nancy and Mnuchin and uh, Trump. So we'll see how that shit goes down. 
they don't get that together, I'm gonna get on and talk about them like a dog. I don't know about anybody else. It's just, why y'all waste all that fucking time? All these little meetings, all the little, I don't know, back and forth. It's just a lot of weird shit, so we'll see what happens with that. And then I saw some, I didn't really look into it, but I guess Bill Cosby got a really nice shot. So, yeah. But anyway, that's the topics. You know what I'm saying? That's me saying, sup, bro. So I hope y'all have a great day, great week, all that. Thanks for giving me your time. Make sure to like and subscribe. And I'll check y'all next time. Keep the bullshit out and your energy up. Peace.